How's it going everybody? Welcome back. So a quick video just to show you guys the best VPNs if you're looking for VPNs that are as compatible as they can be, whether you're looking to connect your VPN to a router, a smart TV, Mac, Windows, Android, your streaming stick, your Android TV, your Nvidia streaming device, or whatever it is that you're looking to connect your VPN on. So all of these VPNs, you've got Express, Nord, and Surfshark, they're all as compatible as they can be no matter what device you're on and if your device is not compatible there are still other ways to connect it such as through routers or through a virtual vpn through your pc and you connect let's say your console to your pc and also through dns so there are ways even for devices that are not natively compatible with vpn applications now let's talk about the vpns that i chose that'll be express nord and surfshark now i've tested over 20 of the best vpns in the market and i've narrowed it down to these three as the best overall so you can pick and choose depending on what you're looking for but they all do work remarkably well with accessing streaming services they allow for torrenting without any bandwidth limitations or throttling they have exceptional speed and performance very good security with you know the highest grade encryption and strict no locks policies so they're not going to be collecting your data and selling it to third parties or if let's say there's some sort of a government subpoena or whatever they will not adhere to that because these VPNs, they really do take the privacy of their users very seriously. I mean, it is the VPN provider's reputation on the line here, so they better stick to what they promise. And they have, as far as I can tell, over the past two to three years, I've been using these VPNs. They have been as good as they can be. Honestly, they constantly have independent audit reports to make sure that they're on top of their game. And if there are any kind of issues in their system or network, they can just get it fixed immediately and so as far as trustworthiness and reliability these vpns are doing wonders now again you're not going to buy all of them so i'm going to help you decide which one could be the best choice for you so express vpn is going to be the best option if you're looking for something that is as easy to use as possible as you can tell right here just a single button and you're good to go so if you're looking for consistency reliability arguably the best privacy policy in the business ease of use over 3,000 servers in 100 in five countries and the ability to secure up to eight devices per subscription. ExpressVPN is a great option to have here. Now NordVPN is going to be the best well-rounded VPN that offers a whole bunch of bonus features for a very reasonable price. You've got over 5,800 servers in 60 countries and you'll be able to secure up to six devices per subscription. And again, you're getting comparable performance and security, but as far as ease of use, as you can tell, you do have more options, but that does come with a little bit of kind of clicking around and trying to find out what each option does. So if you're just looking for a simple VPN that's super easy to use and gets the job done, again, ExpressVPN is the way to go. NordVPN will offer more for the money, if I have to be honest, but you're not getting the same experience. And you do have 45 less countries than Express with Nord. So keep that in mind. And if you go for Nord, make sure that the countries you have with NordVPN are the ones that you're looking for. For the most part, there's plenty in in Europe and North America. Now, if you're looking for the best budget option that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost, this is where Surfshark comes in handy, especially that you're able to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just a single subscription. And you still get all the necessary features that you get with the more expensive VPNs, including some specialty servers and the kill switch and split tunneling and whatnot. And not to mention that there are over 3,200 servers in a hundred countries. And of course, being able to share your VPN subscription with your friends and family is a very nice plus. But as far as compatibility, they're all super compatible with whatever device you're using it on. And for devices that are not natively compatible, again, there are other ways which we can talk about later. And if you do have questions, by the way, feel free to leave them in the description down below. Besides that, you'll find links to pricing and discounts as well as the full reviews in the description down below, as I mentioned earlier. And comment below if you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.